I've been at Palm Beach International Airport since about 5 o'clock this evening, and the line at the Delta counter behind me has gotten slightly shorter, definitely not what we were seeing earlier today. However, there's still plenty of people waiting around trying to make changes due to cancellations and delays. For some, it's meant a later flight, but for others, it's meant a missed flight. Long lines of travelers at Palm Beach International Airport full of people waiting to get help from airlines after an IT outage brought airline operation systems to a halt. Anita Shrub patiently waits to get travel assistance from Delta. Came in at 515 and just waiting in line here. It's very, very slow. Shrub has waited over an hour and a half. She, like many others, just wants to make her connecting flight for a vacation. I was on the phone for about three hours. Nobody picked up. I went over to the kiosk to see if I could change my flight and it says you have to talk to an agent. So I have, you know, this is my only way to solve this. The massive mess was not part of anyone's plans. Delta representatives offered food and water to those searching for solutions. We walked into this chaotic mess. We did plan for lots of things, but this was not one of them. After what seemed like endless hours to get some answers, Gillian Townsie and her husband weren't happy about the solution. They were able to get us rebooked on a flight for tomorrow around 2 p.m. And so we asked about hotel accommodations, food vouchers, and they said, nope, they weren't doing that because it wasn't Delta's fault. So we're just on our own. The delays causing a domino effect for so many travelers. I was supposed to take off at 7-Eleven and then it was delayed where it would be 45 minute delay. And then now it's 9-16, so I will totally miss the connection. Shrub hopes to rebook her flight. Until then, she's unsure where she'll end up tonight. Cassandra Garcia, WPTV News.